Ever feel like your heart is literally racing when you're stressed? Well, you're not wrong. And what's scarier is that over time, that feeling isn't just a feeling. It's a physical process that can seriously damage your heart. Let's break down the science behind how stress can lead to heart disease. It all starts with our ancient survival system. When you're facing a stressful situation, like a crazy deadline at work or a near miss in traffic, your brain's HPA axis, or hypothalamic pituitary adrenal axis, springs into action. It floods your body with hormones like cortisol and adrenaline. This is your classic fight-or-flight response. Your heart starts pounding, your senses sharpen, you're ready to either fight a tiger or run from it. In the short term, this is a lifesaver. But here's the problem. Our modern lives are full of chronic stress. We're not running from tigers, but we have constant pressure from work, finances, and relationships. So instead of a short burst, our bodies are in a constant state of fight or flight. This means those stress hormones, cortisol and adrenaline, stay elevated. And what does that do? It keeps your heart rate high, your blood pressure up, and your blood sugar elevated. Day in and day out, your heart is working overtime with no breaks. This long-term hormonal bath has devastating effects. Chronic inflammation starts to brew throughout your body. Your levels of LDL, the bad cholesterol, can spike. All of this creates the perfect storm for plaque to build up inside your arteries, a condition called atherosclerosis. Your arteries get stiffer and narrower, making it harder for blood to flow to your heart. This is the direct path to heart attacks and strokes, but wait, there's more. Ever notice that when you're stressed, you crave junk food? That's cortisol talking. It cranks up your appetite, specifically pushing you towards fatty, sugary, high-calorie comfort foods. A slice of pizza or a donut feels so good in the moment but it's actively contributing to the very cardiovascular risks that stress is already creating. And let's not forget about sleep. Stress is a notorious sleep thief. When you can't sleep, your cortisol levels get even higher the next day. This creates a vicious cycle. Stress ruins your sleep and lack of sleep makes you more stressed. All the while, your heart is taking a beating from the constant pressure and hormonal imbalance. So are we doomed? Absolutely not. The most powerful thing about understanding this biology is that it gives you the power to fight back. You can actively lower your stress hormones. Things like regular exercise, even a brisk walk, can work wonders. Mindfulness practices like meditation or just a few deep breaths can calm your nervous system in real time. And don't underestimate the power of social connection. Talking to a friend, hugging a loved one, these things release hormones that counteract cortisol. By making these heart smart choices a part of your daily routine, you're not just managing stress. You are actively protecting your heart on a biological level. So next time you feel that stress creeping in, remember the connection, take a deep breath, and make a choice that your heart will thank you for.